Hi, this is author philosopher Ronald Lee Springer for ethicsunderground.com, returning with a continuation of the reading of Moral Armor, Chapter 7, Part 5, The True Worth of a Man. College could not contain me. The pace, the application, I had little tolerance for theoretical instructors who lacked real-world experience. I left school because I wanted an education. Now, school is getting more tailored. It is beginning to reflect the true needs of commercial enterprises, as well as fitting into varied lifestyles for students of all ages. But back then, self-help was in full swing, and I found the most valuable skills in the latest business and philosophy books, anything special interest written by a master, mixed with my own experiments. The self-help genre has answers for everyone. Such programs make it a lot easier for the teacher to be in the right place at the right time. Formal education can be very valuable, but self-made man doesn't stop there. He seeks knowledge wherever he can find it. I remember having questions about so many things, answers I was supposed to pretend to have already. I was made fun of for admitting my uncertainty, and those who taunted would get hostile with any serious query. The best in each field were my teachers, through authorship. American presidents and statesmen, psychologists, philosophers, and businessmen. They brought me up, but they neglected to mention the poor treatment the self-taught would suffer for their efforts. I reached a point of indignation where convincing or seeking acknowledgement just wasn't worth it anymore, yet I was entranced with my style of living. I loved the advancement and the discovery, but those appreciative souls were few, and those who penalized were many. I was held up at another turning point. I couldn't give up my values and couldn't give up the world. If I continued forward, I was bound for more pain, yet I couldn't turn back and be happy. I couldn't shut down and conform. But pain from the outside never matched pain from the inside, so I kept going to arrive at my own golden rule. Warrior note, one must be shameless about learning. I found many instructors who teach and work in their fields, and I took their classes. I found a mix of theory and practicality worked best for me, an apprenticeship education similar to that found in Europe, tailored to my interests alone, along paths acknowledged as commercially valuable. Such an education has cost no less, probably more as it has become a lifelong pursuit. But my conscience is clear. None of my time has been wasted, and no false patterns have been ingrained. Now, since I wrote this, I've completed a bachelor's degree and a master's degree as a result of the 2008-2010 economic crash. Didn't have much of a choice. Uh, one great thing that came out of it, though, is I wrote uh, an ebook about my bachelor's program titled Bachelor Monkey, and you can get that at bachelormonkey.com or at ethicsunderground.com. Uh, there's a link there to the website as well, and it shows you how to complete a bachelor's degree if you have some experience already uh, in your life in as little as a year. I did it personally in one year and three months. So that was a four-year degree in one year and three months, and then I went on to finish a master's and then did uh, postgraduate work at Harvard as well. So I hope that can help you out. Well, that's all for now. Next up is self-help. I split these videos up by subject so that you'd have a better chance of finding moral armor and then perhaps go through the whole thing for free. Why? To help create a leader in every life. Sound civilization stair steps up from sound coherence to sound individual to productive groups of mature individuals. Self-hatred drives fear-driven people in our world to wipe out the individual, so we need moral armor to protect ourselves and the future of mankind. Click subscribe and leave a thumbs up if you'd like to help wipe out moral confusion fast and make the world a better place. If you'd like to go to the next level, you'll find Moral Armor's Patreon link in the show notes. For a $5 contribution, you'll get a PowerPoint video that explores the keys to Moral Armor visually, and it also includes my latest book, The Care and Feeding of Freedom, as a download. Your support is most appreciated. Thanks for watching. See you next time.